Hey, what's up folks? In this project, we're 3D printing selfie action figures. You can 3D scan your family members to make modified action figures. We scanned our heads and added a ball socket so we can snap fit onto existing action figures. These are printed in flexible filament and feature painted details like the eyes and hair. The built-in ball socket allows for articulation so you can pose your selfie action figures and have fun playing with them. These were a hit with the kids and we think these will make a great gift for the whole family. Most action figures feature removable parts and feature a ball joint for their heads. These aren't standard size, so you'll need to use calipers to measure the diameter of the ball joints. We used our phone to capture different angles of our head using the Polycam app for iOS. Check out the guide on the Adafruit Learning System for a full step-by-step -step tutorial. To capture a good scan, you'll want to get photos underneath the chin and the top of the head. Your subject will need to remain very still, so patience is really important. Also avoid wearing glasses, hats, or anything reflective. Once you capture a decent scan, you can export an OBJ file and import that into your preferred CAD program. We used Tinkercad to create a watertight mesh for 3D printing. Importing 3D scans into Tinkercad automatically closes any holes and repairs the mesh. We used the primitive cube as a hole to cut away at the model, leaving just the head. Position your cut right below the chin to avoid having to use support material. Our ball socket is made up of two perimeters and joined together. These can be resized to fit the ball joint in your action figure. Position it right underneath the neck and combine the objects to create a ready to print scan. To bring out the details, you can paint on features using a dry brushing technique using various pigments. A fine pointed brush or toothpick can be used to add on small details like eyebrows and pupils. You can also mix different colors to match the character's bodily features. We printed several copies so that we could experiment with different pigments and painting techniques. We were really surprised how well these turned out with just hobbyist 3D printers. We hope this inspires you to try 3D scanning and making your own selfie action figures. Thank you so much for watching and be sure to subscribe for more projects from Adafruit.